Hello and welcome. In this video, I'm going to show you how to produce a set of descriptive summary statistics using the data analysis tool pack. So I have a set of data here that stretches to 25 entries. And if I want to produce some descriptive summary statistics, we do that by first installing the data analysis tool pack because it will not always be pre-installed for you. If you do want to check if yours has already been installed, go to data and it should be located right here. So here I have data analysis, which is our data analysis tool pack. If it's not there, you're going to have to install it. And to do that, simply follow these four steps. Go file, options, add-ins, and select the data analysis tool pack. Once you have it installed, it's very easy to use. You will simply click on data analysis and then you have a bunch of different things you can do here. For example, you can do stuff like correlation or regression, but what we're looking for is the descriptive statistics, which are here. So click on that, hit OK. And then we have a few things we have to do in order to produce those descriptive statistics. Firstly, we have our input range, which is just the day that you want those statistics to be produced from. So we want to include all of our data entries, all 25 of them. So I highlight all of those. And then you can hit enter. And then we have grouped by either columns or rows. So this is a column. So I will select column. Labels in the first row, that's if you have a, a label on the very top. Or if you have multiple rows, you might have labels for all of those. I don't, so I'll leave that blank. And then we have where we want to output this. You can output it in a new workbook, a new worksheet, or just anywhere you select. So for example, if I say output range, click here. And I could click this square here and it will output right there. And finally, I also want the summary statistics. So I'm going to click on that. And if we hit OK, it will produce it right here. We can change the name and stuff, of course. But most importantly, we have all of our summary statistics. So we have mean, standard error, median, mode, standard deviation, and so on. And we might just make that a bit easier to read by highlighting it, going format cells, number, and everything to two decimal places. And there you go. That's how you produce a set of descriptive summary statistics. If you have any questions or any feedback, please put it in the comments below. Consider subscribing to my channel, it really helps me out. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.